Good morning, Arlington Heights. Here are today's announcements. If you would please stand for the pledges and the moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Thank you. You may be seated. Attendance recovery for first semester begins on January 11th, Tuesday through Thursday of every week, mornings at 7.15, afternoons at 3.50 in the lower level of the library. Attendance recovery for the fall semester will be available on Saturday, January 22nd and Saturday, February 5th from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. in the C building again. Fall semester attendance recovery, January 22nd and February 5th. Students, if you've received a late notice, please be sure to return your books to the library ASAP. As a reminder, we do not charge late fees, so if you have a book that's overdue, turn it in. Our blood drive is happening Friday, January 28th. Be sure to scan the QR code on the screen for all the details or talk to student council. Again, blood drive, Friday, January 28th. Arlington Heights has earned the AP Computer Science Female Diversity Award. Congratulations to Mr. Smith and all you young ladies who are breaking through the proverbial glass ceiling by taking computer science classes. Way to go, Yellow Jackets. Announcing the AHHS Book Club Tuesdays during both lunches. Bring a friend and your lunch to the library to discuss your favorite books. The Fellowship of Christian Athletes meets every Thursday at 745 in room B0066. Come on by or talk to Coach Korn for more details. Would you like to meet true friends in Christ? Join the path in faith? All are welcome to join the LOL Club. That's the Living Out Loud for Christ Club. Meetings are Wednesdays right after school in room 208. UIL Journalism meets every Wednesday right after school in room B1035 or see Miss Wiles for more information about the UIL Journalism competitions. If you like to read and analyze books like The Great Gatsby, then UIL Literary Criticism is for you Wednesdays after school at 345 in room 2009 or see Mr. Collins if you have any questions. If you'd like to be alert to new discoveries and information in the area of science, then the UIL Science Club is for you Wednesdays after school at 345 in room 2009. Again, UIL Science, Wednesdays after school in room 2009. Do you want to make a difference in your school? Be a part of a group that cares for the community? Learn positive life skills? Well then, UV4C, United Voices for Change, is for you Wednesdays during second lunch in room B0068 or see Mrs. Crawford for details. Trials for the 22-23 Heights Cheer Squad are coming up soon. We are looking for both males and females. If you're interested, please fill out the form linked in the QR code at the bottom of the announcement. And there's also a mandatory tryout meeting on February 7th or 8th at 6.30 p.m. in the cafeteria. Again, scan the QR code for the interest form and be sure to attend one of the mandatory tryout meetings.
Here's a call out for any girls who are interested in playing flag football. The season is starting soon. See the details on the next slide or see Coach White or Coach Sanders for more information. Remember, breakfast and lunch are free to all students this school year. Here's a list of today's lunch items and tomorrow's breakfast items. Do you need a jacket or a sweater because it's cold outside? Or maybe a new pair of socks? Or maybe you need to look a little bit more sharp for an interview you have scheduled? Then the care closet is available for all height students now located in room B0042. Again, room B0042 for the care closet. Attention seniors, $10,000 scholarship opportunity. 30 selected applicants will receive a one-time $10,000 scholarship Scan the QR code for all the details for the Rainwater High School Scholars Scholarship. Hey Yellow Jackets, remember, attendance counts. Be here every day, all day. Be sure to show your height spirit by making sure your trash ends up in the trash can, not on the floor or in the parking lot outside. And let's make it another great day at Arlington Heights, where students and staff are known, valued, and inspired.